what were your thoughts on the way the team performed on Saturday night? Uh, first of all, I have to say how proud I am um, of just everybody involved from, from top to bottom. Um, what, a, what a magnificent effort. What a magnificent effort. I think, uh, first of all, I have to congratulate the players. I thought the players to a man were 10 out of 10 across the board. Um, and I, I think in terms of the staff, I thought Luis managed the game impeccably well. Um, I thought Jake Davis, the goalie coach, that, that, that sort of coupled up as the assistant on the night with, with Marshall Bushnell as well, were, were fabulous. Um, the communication was really slick and clean and changes when, when the changes were made, they were made at the perfect time. And I just think, you know, it, it, what it does is it goes to show our alignment of our, you know, of our staff on... You know, the fact that we're missing two members of staff, how the players can still go out and follow the game plan, how the staff just seamlessly transition into those roles. So it was, it was brilliant. And, and again, I think you know what I'm going to say, but, I, you know, I felt the fans through the television screen. I thought the fans were superb. You know, it was a really big game. Miami came in unbeaten in their last five. And, you know, I was listening to, to the commentary. They were favourites. And... I thought it was a shutout performance. I thought the first 30 minutes with the ball, we were magnificent. I felt like, you know, the goals came at a great time. You know, really, two really well-executed goals, Barrera getting two assists. I, I couldn't have been more happy. Would you say that this was a statement win? Yeah, com- completely. I don't think you could have made up the, the restrictions that we were going to face last week. And again, the staff that were present managed to shield the players from, from a lot of that. And then the players themselves to be able to really, you know, button down and get on with it and just show how, how they can behave on the pitch in, a, in adversity to get a clean sheet, score two really good goals. I, I thought we were valued for three or four, if I'm honest with you. I thought some of the chances we created were excellent. And again, you see how we defend our goal. It really means something to us. So, you know, it was magnificent across the board. And, you know, I feel, I feel like the staff that were present should be congratulated. What was the week like for you and for Coach Stead just being separated from the team, but of course certainly wielding, you know, Louise mentioned it in his post-game press conference. You weren't there, you know, physically, but you were there throughout the entire week leading everybody through. What was the week like for you? It was another really interesting experience. Um, you know, I wasn't able to, I'm very hands-on on the pitch, very hands-on with the players, um, steady as well, but you know, I think Luis done a great job in translating the message of what we wanted from the game plan. You know, he, he led Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and you could see the impact that he had. Um, for the game itself, you know, it was very difficult watching it through the television. You know, I was linked up live with the bench. Um, but it was it was a different experience trying to trying to sort of help any in any way I could manage it, managing the game through the TV. But listen, that it was it was a a, a, a mammoth effort from from everybody involved in terms of the guys that were there. Um, it's something which I don't want to have to repeat again. But I now have the you know I think we have the evidence and the proof is in the pudding, as we say in England, that you know our staff are able to step up to the plate and perform. Now you turn your focus on to Pittsburgh. Uh, you'll still be uh, quarantined for a little bit, but is your expectation that you'll be back on the sidelines this weekend? Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll be back. Um, I come, you know, I'm, I'm out of my quarantine at the back end of this week, so I'll be on the pitch with the players as well, which would be, you know, which would be really good. Um, leading up to that, again, it's, you know, it's all systems go. We need to really concentrate on another big game. Um, going to Pittsburgh will be a tough place to go, but you know, we know now that we've proved to everybody that in those big games we can come out on top, and it's now about us concentrating on ourselves and making sure that we can follow up a really good win with another fantastic performance.